Hello everyone, Alex is here. Today I have something I've been using for the last couple of months from Canon, which is a small printer that doesn't require ink to print. And the one that I have here is the Canon IV2 pure white color. It's also available in pink, but I personally found the white one looks better. Inside the box you will find the printer, USB-C cable for charging, and 10 papers for printing. Now the IV2 can only do one size, which is 3 by 2 inches. So if you're looking for bigger size images, this is not for you. So it's basically made for sketches and greeting cards, or if you want to print small photos of your family and friends. This printer uses zinc paper, so it doesn't need ink to print, which is convenient for a printer this size. There are multiple ones that require ink and paper, and I found it really annoying because you have to keep an eye on it in case one of the printing ingredients is missing. On the IV2, all you need is the paper and of course the printer, and you can print up to 5 photos on one charge, and it takes around 2 hours to charge from 0 to 100%. However, you can use it while charging, so if you have a lot of images you want to print, you don't have to keep waiting for it. Another cool thing about this printer is that the prints can be used as stickers, which is a very handy feature considering the size of the output. For example, you can stick it in your diaries or in your office, unlike the printers that doesn't use zinc, like the Kodak P300R, which has higher quality images but requires both ink and paper and you have to use tape to stick it. Speaking of quality, the images out of this printer are sharp and crisp, with a lot of details. Again, it's not the best, but it's definitely good enough for small photos. So all you have to do to make it work is to use the app Mini Prints. And from there you can customize your prints by adding frames, emojis, or even edit the photos. And it takes around 30 seconds to print, with an awesome animation on the screen. Something I should mention though, that if you go to Walmart for example, and print the same size photos, you can get higher quality images for a cheaper price. So if you don't use it a lot, it's better for you if you print it at your local stores. But again, you will lose the adhesive feature. However, if you print multiple times a week, maybe for your book or your friends, then having a printer like the IV2 is definitely something you will enjoy. The price of the print is 0.6 Canadian dollars or 0.4 US dollars and the price of the printer is around 150 so it's definitely not for everyone but i can see some people interested in this kind of products if you are one of these people let me know in the comments where do you think this printer will come in handy i personally know photographers who use this kind of printers to give small prints as an extra after the shoot for the client which is a good idea to hook them and stand out anyway that's all for today don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and see you guys in the next video.